Selena and I already love this premiere. It's the best thing in my life. But I think I'm, we're already late for the movie, so let's go that because I'm late for the movie. Thank you, bye. Mama's 50 year remembrance, Abby. Don't tell me that you're expecting the rest of the family to come over next weekend. It will be different because I have a plan. And she said it. Very, very wicked plan. How can mommy have financial assets we did not know anything about? It was saying something like uh, maybe 100 million. <laughs> From the first day, I knew the movie was going to be a crazy movie. I knew it was going to be mad. So I've been looking forward to the day that um, we finally get to watch it on the big screen. Well, I guess the day is here. I played the role of Barry Wonder in the movie introducing the Kujus. And it was really, really, really a nice movie. I enjoyed myself on set. You know, I tried to bring in my own sauce, my own flavor, my own energy. And everybody else brought their A-game. So imagine me, Bisola, Kunle, Femi, you know, Bimbo bringing their A game to a movie that is well produced. And when I mean well produced, I mean like the producers did not, um, they did not try to mise, they did not try to hold anything back in terms of like production quality. So all in all, it's a fantastic film. Well, um, I actually came out for Big Star Lion, I must say. I'm actually looking forward to a family story, a beautiful picture. I want to see Brokel Jusoya. I've not seen her in this kind of thing before. I want to see her. I want to see every other person, I must say the truth. I just want to see a beautiful story. That's very important for me. And I want to see everybody do their thing. So when I got the script, I was like, ha. Huh. The other said, okay, you have to do this. You, this is you. I see you in this. I said, are you sure? Okay, if you believe in me, I'm my God. Okay, I'll go ahead. And thank God I did. I'm glad, I'm proud, I'm happy. Beautiful cast and crew. Amazing people, very accommodating, very friendly people. They are very good to work with, especially Beardo Steven. The director is... I love her. We're going to Badagri. I got to the arrival of our tuba. Money back. Auntie, Auntie, this is not Tory Center. This is Kuju Family House. It is beautiful. Like, it's great. I, I, did, I never expected it, but it's great. Um, one thing that, that I, I was asking, I don't know who casted like the roles. They picked the perfect person for every every role, from the children to the old ones. So everybody, everybody did amazing. It's beautiful. To be honest with you, I cannot say that we had challenges because this was one film that really went smooth. Location, everything really, really went smooth. Maybe because we were filming during the pandemic, so you know people were not really out there. Um, but everything just really worked together for our good for the production, even the weather cooperated with us. OMG! It was hilarious. I enjoyed every bit. Shout out to Bisola, the Kuju family. <laughs> I played the role of Pamela Kuju in the movie Introducing the Kujus. Um, Pamela is married to the first of the Kuju siblings, Mountain. And um, it was, I think it was pretty interesting, you know, playing the role of the dotting wife. And it's even more amazing to know that people have received it very well. So it's a very good day we're having over here today at the premiere of the movie Introducing the Kujus. Auntie, this is not Tory Center. This is Kuju Family House. When I saw the trailer, I knew straight up that it was going to be a very interesting one. I have a lot of characters I'm looking forward to seeing. And also, it's it's the big screen. So the, the, everything that surrounds you, the sound, everything is going to make it all worth it. I know that the content already is very good, so I'm looking forward to seeing it. I play the character Abby. Abby happens to be a non kuju, but a kuju at the end of the day because she's um the daughter to a kuju. Um, as for my character on set and you know being with other characters. Bisola is my sister. I'm sure you guys know that. And um, the other Steven I've worked with years and years, you know, before before now. And um, Timini, Fola, Mimi, I've met before. So it was actually like a smooth journey. Although it was in the middle of a pandemic, but we were able to scale through. So it was an amazing experience. What the hell is going on with this apron? Why are you wearing the apron? Oh, <laughs> photo shoot low up. OMG, like.
like it was surreal. At the point, I had tears in my eyes. Like, oh my god! Like people are like, it's like just really. I'm, I'm really speechless. Um, hearing them laugh, hearing the awes, and then um, after the movie, everybody coming out and just being like, oh my god, you did amazing! This is fantastic! Ah, my head, my head is just busting! Like, oh my god, you know, like it just felt so good. I must confess, it felt so good, and I feel fulfilled, honestly. I did a film with the director in 2018 called um, Looking for Barmy. That was beyond Stephen. And the story worked. Um, it seemed like we understood each other. It seemed like I liked the way she layers her stories. They're not usually elaborate stories, but they're usually stories well told. That, that's why I like her. So anything she brings to me, I'm always already biased. So when she called me and she said, I'd like to be in a film. It's a family film, as I say no more. You send me the script. Let me know who else is on it. Let me know what my character is. And as I read the story, I was like, well, it's a good family story. I read it, I continued to read it. I said, this is not, it's intense, but it is, but it is still light. This is my first time of a lot of people looking at it in front of me. It was so fun, I loved it. I loved it so much. And thanks so much, everyone, thanks, I love it. I love the movie so much because this is not my first time, but this, this looks like my first time, but this is not my first time. This is, this is the best movie in the world. I love it. What the hell is going on with this apron? Why are you wearing apron? Ah, I'm going to photo shoot. <laughs> the Kujus, very interesting uh, movie. The comedy actually spoke to family, the importance of family in our lives. We cannot get enough information about ourselves on social media, but very important for us to always come together, to have like a family dinner, family lunch, it's very important. All the artists, uh, they, they, they did very well. And I'm proud of Visola, she has really, yeah, she, she's making us proud. Thank you. On behalf of myself and everybody that worked on this project, um, when we started, we set off um, to make a classic. And um, from the reception so far and the feedback we've received, it's very, very, very clear that we made a film for all seasons. A movie that you can watch again and again and again. A movie that you can relate with, uh, with or to in one way or another. So I feel a deep sense of pride today, um, following um, the reception from those who watched the movie.